Hi, I'm Connie Legrand. You're watching WGHB. So everybody remembers Trey Phipps from last year. This past summer, he moved to Savannah, Georgia, but he is back and our newest member of WGHB. Say hi, Trey. Brady and Kiara have been begging Coach Fuller to do a senior spotlight segment. So here we go to his two favorite seniors. What's up, GHS? This is your boy, Sonora Smith, you know what I'm saying? I'm a senior at Gavin High School. My, bo my most memorable moment at Gavin High when I first came here as a freshman and I lost going to class. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody got lost as a freshman if you didn't know. Most memorable moment about being here at GHS? First time I got rolled up, man. That's all. What's your nickname? Bird. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> as many of you have heard, the leader of the band, Mike Calvary, Brandon McDaniel, passed away last Tuesday in a car accident. His friends and family put his journal together and are selling them for $5. The journal includes his experience on a mission trip to India right before he died. You can see Blythe for more details. The yearbook staff is still selling yearbooks. They are also selling Krispy Kreme donuts for $5. See any staff member or Miss Ramsey for a box. Spring break is coming up very soon. In fact, next Friday is our last day. Trey and Bradley went around our school asking students about their spring break plans. What's up, Gabney High School? This is Trey Phipps, and we're reporting to see what all the students here are doing for their spring break. So let's go see. Tomorrow, what you doing for spring break? I go to Myrtle Beach. Myrtle Beach? Yeah. Sweet. Sweet. <laughs> Going to do a, a twisty backflip on my dirt bike on a 100 foot ramp. <laughs> oh man, I'm a pack and we're moving back to Gabney. Yay, yay! Brittany, what are you doing for spring break? For spring break, I'm going to my cousin T house. Well, I'm planning on, you know, wrestling, running, lifting weights, you know, using what I always do. Uh, nothing, just hanging out with friends, chilling, going up to PC with my brother, chilling up there. Me and uh, Sean Calvert heading down to Panama City, Florida. We're gonna hit the beach, find some girls. Definitely for spring break, going to party. Don't worry, Miss Davis, you know it's a good kind of party. You can, you're invited too, come on. <laughs> well, I know what I'm doing. I'm unpacking because your boy's moving back. Now back to y'all at the news desk. Channel 7 News visited the 7th period Broadcast 1 class this week. Some of our students were interviewed. The segment aired Tuesday night. Now to Jonathan Vaughn with sports. Appreciate it, guys. <clears throat> the baseball team improved their record to 3-0 in the region after starting off 0-2 in non-region play. They had a great performance by Cameron Culp, who only gave up three hits on, in Friday's game. Tuesday, Tyler Wilson was on the mound, and he got the win over Fort Mill. And not so happy news, the soccer team is trying to regroup and get a better team and get back on tra track and start winning some matches. Same goes for the girls as they drop through a 1-7 to seven match on Tuesday against Fort Mill. The Gaffney Tennis team won a match in the Bowling Springs tournament, <clears throat> but they lost Tuesday against Fort Mill in a 6-0 battle. The tennis team is working hard to improve. Um, in other news, Julie Surratt had a, uh, had a great game Tuesday against Fort Mill. She pitched a perfect game, having no errors, no hits, and no walks. Um, that was against jo that was against Fort Mill Tuesday. Joe Craig has just broke er, has just broke the school 100 meter record with running a 10.2. In order for him to break the state record, it is going to be laser times, and he's going to have to break a 10.35. He also is going to be in the running for breaking the 200 meter which is a 21.4. That, that's what he's running right now. For, in order for him to break it, he needs a 21.17. For him to break the, these records, he needs to run these times in the state meet. I look for the team to grow and get better, and hopefully we come out with another W. <laughs> that's how we get down, baby! Thank you, and that's all for sports. Good!